Welcome back guys in another video. So today, first of all, it's extremely freaking hot. It's more than 31 degrees, which is terrible, especially if you want to do street photography. It's just like unbelievable. But today I'm going to use Sony uh, G Master second generation 7200 mm f2.8 with Sony A7 III. So basically I took almost 5000 pounds uh, in gear to do some street photography, which was quite risky. So I hope you will enjoy the video. And uh, the first time I used this lens, like literally first time I used this, the, used this lens was in the race track, which you maybe saw before. It wasn't fun for me to record this because, you know, in UK everything might happen and UK is also known very well from the roadman, typical roadman, which is the person who don't even know how to pull up the trousers. Basically, that's it. Uh, enjoy the video and see you in a second. Here we come with the 72200 f2.8 G Master second generation. As, you, as I said before, I used that previously on the uh, racetrack, but now it's like first time I'm using. I'm gonna to use it on the street, and let's see what we can capture. To be honest, because I haven't done street for a while, so I think this is a good starting point of the bridge but I need to go to the other side hopefully you can see it but I'm not quite sure on the phone it's showing that it's supposed to be raining later on so it's going to be around 7 o'clock unfortunately and it's 30 degrees still so let's see if it will rain soon or not it would be awesome especially for this big boy we actually try to get a photo of the bus driver but there is a guy exactly on front of me which I don't want to take a picture of but yeah you know as a tourist they most likely want to take pictures with the bus for some reason so yeah it is what it is let's go towards this way and see what we can do so I will go towards me because if I go to the river side of this uh, lens of course security will come to me and there will be unnecessary footage when I'm arguing with someone for no reason so basically I will go here try to find the settings why is this going on to the uh, auto mode something is wrong with it ok now it's at 2.8 and uh, I can change everything I'm going to keep ISO around 250, maybe 320. I have to and try to take some pictures. I don't know why the camera uh, started, you know, whenever I zoom and stuff, changing the aperture by itself. Maybe it's because of the, I don't know, maybe, maybe faulty battery. I have no clue. I hopefully, hopefully the camera, it's not damaged because I don't want to buy anyone for no reason. Maybe I can get quickly here somehow. It's not looking at me, but it doesn't matter, to be honest. It still looks cool. So it doesn't seem like it's going to be raining, but at least there is no su uh, sun. So I can take some photos of the people around me. <coughs> not bad, but I'm going towards... I don't know where I'm going to be on a straight. I'm thinking to go in the middle of the road. I will have better view for the people around me and the other stuff. So let's have a little walk. I think I found my target. It's a doorman of, uh, I don't know, some store with the suits. As soon as I'm on 200 millimeter, I don't need to worry to come close to him. I just need to aim and uh, take the shot. Oh, come on. Cool. It somehow worked. It's nice. As soon as I do my moody style, and it's perfect because on the camera you can't say. Never trust the LCD from the camera, to be honest. Never. Like I said, I'm trying to find interesting people like person before, like, you know, people in suits and all their stuff, and to be careful on the bus. Otherwise, the lens will be damaged, which I wouldn't be happy about, to be honest. No one would be happy if you damage the G Master, but you know what I'm trying to say. Shit. There's literally no one. Interesting, you know. And this dude, even though I don't like the shot, 
I can make it look nice. So even though <clears throat> the weather keeps changing, I really hope for a little bit of rain. Just a bit, I'm not saying like, you know, shower, typical shower, but you know, just a little bit. So it, will, it would be great. Let me try to take some shot of people in front of me. Weather will pass, but I'm to be far away from the um, street. So I'm not gonna damage my lens. There will be unnecessary, you know, I mean, if there will be a truck coming or something like this. But the sun is literally pissing me off. I don't know if I got that, it's slightly overexposed. But slightly. Maybe I can cover this. So you will see on the screen already the edit. And uh, let's see what we can get else. I think we could change the location. So we have more shadow. And uh, it's gonna be better for me because it's too much sun, to be honest. That's a nice motorcycle in front of me. Let me change to, I don't know, a 4.5, 500 of the shutter and uh, take a shot. starting our street photography finally because there is some person reading the book I'm using a flexible spot I'm shooting also f2.8 I will put down the ISO to 100 and uh, let's wait for the guy to pass just expose and uh, that's it it's sick I mean it will be sick if I'll check through viewfinder let me have a look it is sick and I had to do this weird gesture with this because the thing is whenever I was shooting close to my eye and I was not using viewfinder you know the sensor from the viewfinder picked up that I'm looking to uh, through it and it was always switching you know to viewfinder instead of LCD and basically I mopped the button to the part down and that's it basically that's why I always when I want to check the viewfinder I press down and basically that's it I missed the shot, fuck's sake. <laughs> yeah, or maybe not, maybe I can recover it. Yeah, I think I can because even though I'm shooting 16 by 9 I'm still saving the, you know, 3 by 2 on my my 16, whatever it is, you know what I mean. This lady... Banger. I think it was a mistake because there's some sort of festival or some shit which will be annoying why the hell this camera does this? is it the last minute of the A7 III or what? look, I don't know if you can see them on the screen but I press the gallery I try to zoom, okay now it's zoomed but yeah, sometimes when I try to zoom it's basically the screen is flickering and switching on to the photo mode instead of the gallery I don't know why so unfortunately there is some sort of festival and I can't uh, cross without uh, listening to music and uh, I'm not really sure if the security will allow me to go with this and I don't know if there is an exit from the other side or whatever the heck it is so I have to go quite around towards the Piccadilly and the um, uh, I think that's it so I found a better street photographer, better paparazzi than me I'll just show you in a second, just look at this perfect than me Bang Autofocus in this lens is just phenomenal. Yeah, paparazzi 100% sit in one spot and use the kit lens. So basically, to do this shot, I will show you on the screen. Uh, it's out of the um, GoPro because there was a music behind me, but I think it's kind of dope and moody as always I'm doing. Um, I'm going towards uh, Piccadilly now as this is like main area with the tourists and other stuff so there should be a lot of opportunities to take some shots unless there is some stupid music again which hopefully is not there and any person doesn't perform on the street today because otherwise I will have to change the location again so there is one more photo I want to show you and uh, basically it was quite quick but I want to show you because of the style and stuff like this uh, 
Uh, on the camera it's overexposed, but hopefully once I open it on the laptop I can save it. You can see the edit anyway, straight away, so if you see it I, I fix it. If you don't, then I didn't. I just hate these guys. I think I got that kind of... So here is a guy with the um, suit and the cigarette. I'll try to take the picture somehow. Okay. Did they work? No clue. Maybe this one. They are fucking sick. I need to be quick. I think I was quick enough. That's a nice shot. I love this lens because the autofocus is just incredible. Like I just switched off, switch off, Jesus Christ, switch on the camera and the autofocus is picked up. It's less than a second. Otherwise I would lose the photo to be honest. Here is another example of the photo which I just took because I had to cut the music. So the girl smoking is also nice. It wasn't 200 mil. So basically that's it let me go again to the other side and see what can i get from this perspective to be honest i need to keep my eyes open every time like what the fuck i need to keep looking like now for example but of course the person in front of me almost fucked it up but i was lucky enough i think she looked at me as well which is even better and it's a banger to be honest I mean the photo is a banger don't get me wrong I mean don't put in the comments some stupid things so guys that's all for today's video let me know down in the comments how did you like it I might do the night photograph with you with this lens but here now in UK you know now it's summer anyway so even though I want to do some night photography I will have to go at basically like I don't know 9 or 10 p.m which is terrible and uh, I'm just going home now because it's extremely hot as 